Hey, what's up, guys? This is Ricky V. And in today's video, I am doing it again. I am taking posts from the Vintage Muscle community, blurring out the names, and answering the questions, just to give you a sample of what goes on in the Vintage Muscle community on a day-to-day -day basis. This is a great video, guys, so keep watching. Now, this first question is one that we get all of the time, and it goes something like this. So I just started going to the gym for the very first time in my life, and my friend suggested Vintage Muscle, but I have no clue what I should get or what really to do. Any suggestions? Now guys, I made a whole video to help newbies get started when they come into the community to help you get started on what products to use and how to get going. We'll make sure to annotate that video. But real quickly here, bro, I like the Alpha Test Stack. It's very versatile. You can use it for cutting. You can use it for bulking. It's a great one to get started with and make sure to add the Titan Powder. That's a great testosterone booster to help you make the most of your natural test production. And as always, make sure to finish up with the Muscle Support Stack. You can run Titan Powder right along with the Muscle Support Stack. That's your PCT. On to the next one. I think Titan Powder is a must have. I agree with you, bro. Titan Powder is the one product you should be taking when you're on cycle, during PCT and on your time off is very versatile. It's going to help you make the most out of your own natural testosterone production. It's a great product. Haven't been on cycle in a while and was curious, so I bought Titan Spray. Can I take it by itself or should I wait and add it to a stack? Listen, bro, you can use Titan Spray by itself. It's a great testosterone base. As always, you want to finish up your cycle with the muscle support stack. On to the next one. Hey fam, quick question. I'm running the alpha stack now. What to do eight weeks? I'm on week four now. Can I add another stack to my last four weeks? I'm in more of a bulking stage now. Any suggestions? Bros, I made a whole video explaining how you can just extend your cycle from four to eight weeks. We'll make sure to annotate that video. And yes, bro, you can go as far as eight weeks on these vintage muscle products. Just make sure to always use the muscle support stack in the end and add Titan powder during PCT in order to help you make the most out of your own natural testosterone production. Great question. Is this a good method? Running weight test for eight weeks with androgenin, Clan XT, and then on week five, do a PCT with hydroxygenin for four weeks while still using the clan. Now, bros, there's been a bit of debate in the community because some of the advice that I give on this video is different than some of the charts you will see on the webpage. Look, guys, not to worry. There's more than one way to do things. There's more than one way to stack. I might have my own opinions. On the Vintage Muscle website, you'll find other opinions. Both ways are fine. Look, the main difference here is this. I would like you to do four full weeks of PCT when you're not taking any exogenous hormones. Can you start your PCT at week five? Yes, you can. You can start week five while you run your exogenous hormones. No problem. Just make sure that you continue and do another muscle support stack while you're completely off of the stuff. That's all. The way I suggested, you need one muscle support stack used standalone by itself. If you follow some of the website info, you can definitely run two muscle support stacks back to back. Start at week five, and then once you finish that first muscle support stack, you start on the second one. Both ways will work, guys. No need to be confused and no need to worry. You will get great results either way. Next question. Epitest versus win test. What are your thoughts? These are both great ingredients for cutting. Epitest by itself, you can run right along with a bulking cycle. Now you should know that there are two bottles of Epitest in each bottle of Wintest, along with 200 milligrams per serving of 5A OHP. Wintest is part of the God series, is a full stack and a bottle. It's 400 milligrams of active ingredient per day in a bottle that contains 30 servings. It's a great product. Next question, can I take methyl test with wind test and the anabolic shred stack? Yes, you can. You can take methyl test anytime. You can take it on cycle. You can take it during PCT. You can take it after. Methyl test, you do not need to PCT from. You can stack it, no problem. Rock on. Next question, can I keep my supplements in the refrigerator? Quick answer, no you should not bro. Dropping the temperature in your liquids is going to make them fall out of solution. It's going to crash the suspension. Whether you have the God series or the anabolic series, you're going to see some problems with crystallization by dropping the temperature of your products in the refrigerator. So don't do it. Is it a good idea to be mixing test powder with pre-workout before the gym? Quick answer, yes you can. You can mix any of the powders together. You can mix nitric with aminos, with pre-workout, with Titan, any time of the day. All of those play very well together. The only time you would worry is if you were mixing two stimulant powders together, then you might have an issue. You might get some jitters. But right now, the only powder with any sort of stimulants is pre-workout. And that one you can mix right along with any of the other powders in the formula. Rock on. And now for our last question in this video. Are any of the Vintage Muscle Stacks methylated? No, they are not, bro. I made a whole video explaining why the Vintage Muscle products are not going to hurt your liver. We'll be sure to annotate that video. You have no worries. There are no methyl modifications in any of the pro hormones that are sold through Vintage muscle. Your liver is quite safe. Nothing to worry about. Make sure to add the powders to your program. Organa contains a thousand milligrams of NAC 
per serving. Keep rocking with the Vintage Muscle products, bro. Your liver is safe. No worries. All right, guys, those were all the questions in today's videos. If you have any questions of your own, make sure to head over to vintage-muscle.com and click on the community link. As of today, we're nearing 21,000 strong and counting. Make sure to come on in and ask your questions, and we're all there to help you out, to give you answers. Thousands of other men on the same journey you are right now using the Vintage Muscle products. You'll get plenty of good answers, so come on in. I'll be there. I'll answer your questions too. All right, guys, that's it for me today. I'll see you on that next one. Peace.